driver is whipping through the mountains. What's up, P Nation? Today's our last day in Poland, and we are headed to Kosice, Slovakia. We're taking a bus there through the mountains, and I heard there's like not a really a border crossing, but then I read something else that said it was like super intense, so I'm excited to see <laughs> how that's gonna end up. We're really hungry right now, so we gotta go to the bakery and get some pastries. just out on the street. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to our favorite bakery in our neighborhood. We've been there three times now. Okay, so this is the third day that I've gotten the same pastry. And it's basically like a croissant pretzel with icing on it and it's really good. I want to say the icing here is really different because it doesn't have a lot of sugar in it. Yeah. Back in America, everything has so much sugar in the icing here. It's just like the consistency of icing with no sugar and the fruits add all the sweetness that you need. It's really good. And there's Leah over there working. I am going to go get a haircut because I needed one for like two months now. So I'm going to see if I can find a place to get a haircut while she's working. Our buses actually leave for six hours. I think I found a place. Woo. I showed him a picture, it's not what it's like, but he did it. So, okay, made it back to Leah, let's see if she even recognizes me. Okay, you should have seen Leah's reaction. She was like, so upset. Anyways, so I put water in it, it's down now, putting the head of shame on. And it's gonna be like this for the next couple of weeks. Okay. And just like that, we have left the place. Leah's gotten over this ridiculous haircut. So, it wasn't as bad for me, but she was like, how could you let him do that? I was mad on his behalf. I wasn't mad at him or his hair. So if you show him a picture and they don't give you what you want, <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know. So now we're walking 10 minutes to the mall to go set another place before we get to Florida bus. Okay, we're taking a break because Leah's having to carry two sacks now. We normally have just our snack sack, but what's in this sack? We have a whole fan in here. So it's so hard to find places that have air conditioning. So we purchased a fan, it cost 30 US dollars. So we're unwilling to buy a fan everywhere we go. So we're literally toting it around Europe with us. And it's so heavy. <laughs> Now we have made it to the train station, which is actually like right next to a mall. Yeah, or it's like the mall's right above it. Yeah. And I don't know. Don't judge us. Don't judge us. We only had so much money left. We decided to go to Burger King. So I was actually pretty excited for this. And these fries were so salty. I'm in heaven. Ah, Burger King. Very refreshing. <laughs> I just looked at myself in the mirror and I was like, who is that? Oh, it was me. <laughs> Anyways. We're on this haircut. We're going to the bus station now. I think it's like two minutes from here. Yeah, we just have to go like underneath this tunnel. I don't know how it connects, but it does. Let's go. And it's so weird because I'm so used to trains being like the way to go in America. If you're gonna choose a train or a bus, you're always gonna choose a train. But here, in America, yeah, in America, it's really the opposite here because trains don't have air conditioning here. So like, you're gonna pay more for a bus because it has air conditioning, it gets you there faster than a train does. Where in America, like, take the train, it has air conditioning, it's nice, and it's sleeper, it has a heating car. But we've never taken a train. But I know people have. <laughs> Definitely not, but it is so good. I'm 
might actually be better than Butter Sport, which is my favorite European chocolate. It is really good. You if you're here, you should get it. It is... Yeah, it's 4.32. We're on time. We're leaving now. It's gonna take how long to get there? Like four and a half hours. I, I think it's called ceviche. But Cosiche. Cosiche. Oh, ceviche Close. is the thing that I want right now. Yeah, raw fish. <laughs> How cold is it here? <laughs> it's really cold. Whew. So far, Slovakia is amazing. The weather is a bit chilly, but all the people here are so nice. And we're back in the castles. Yeah! We have a shower, we have two sinks, what? And an adorable little apartment, comfy, and a loft bed, which we were just dealing with last night. But now we have steps. <laughs> and a coffee and tea set. Spoons, cups, oh, little teacups. Hot water, oh, it's perfect. And like a lot of teas. Okay, so we are out on the town again. We are trying to get a good look at our surroundings and apparently there's a party that's like one block away. Yeah. Okay, so we made it. We were looking for the searchlights and we found the searchlights. Look, they're right there. And it's a beer garden. In like the courtyard of the church. At night. Yeah. What are these people? What is going on? <laughs> Okay, and that is it for this vlog. I think we learned two things today. One, border crossings can just be no border crossings. <laughs> and two, they love beer in Slovakia. <laughs> That's not something new. <laughs> We're headed to... Slovakia! <laughs> I couldn't think of it. Too late? Okay, made it to the train station and... I got Cross the border. 